Good news on inflation came in this morning uh, in December. Uh, it fell from um, 4.9 to 4.6. That's the PPI. That's food and energy and all of that. And wholesale prices fell 0.5%. That's good news. Inflation's coming down. It hasn't been coming down a, a little bit since June. Now, people who dislike President Biden, when they get good news, because it's good news for Biden, they don't like it. That's wrong. Because Americans are suffering. So if inflation comes down, that's good. Keeping in mind that Biden started inflation by attacking the fossil fuel industry the day he took over. That's what ignited all this. Okay? So he caused it, and now it's coming down, but not, not everything. So gasoline dropped 13.4% in December. That's what drove the inflation rate down. But if you go to the grocery store, or the restaurants, or takeouts, or whatever, you know you're paying as much now as you paid in June, even more in some cases. Every time I walk into a new restaurant, I see the menu. It's brand new. Whenever you see a brand new menu in a restaurant, you know prices are going up. That's why they print a new menu. All right, but you should not be rooting against the American people. We want to bring inflation down. But here's something really interesting. Um, the stock market tanked today, at least up until tape time. We're not quite at the close, but it was down at one point almost 500 points. I thought it was going to be up 500 points because this is good news on inflation. The stock market has no confidence in Biden. And one of the reasons why is we're starting to see the big layoffs now. So Microsoft announced today it's going to cut 10,000 people immediately. Amazon announced last week that 18,000 people are going to be laid off. Uh, Meta, Twitter, BlackRock, Bed Bath & Beyond, they're done, Bed Bath & Beyond. Goldman Sachs, they're all laying people off. Now, that has nothing to do with inflation. That has to do with they're not making as much money as they want to make, these corporations. Okay. So they're laying people off. That's what leads to a recession. The, all of it is, is combined, but if there's going to be a recession this year, oh, it's going to be horrible because then you combine the higher prices with people losing their jobs. Inflation at its highest level in 40 years. Interest rates skyrocketing. We all know that. Market experts like Jamie Dimon, CEO of J.P. Morgan, not only predict a recession, but are using scary terms like economic hurricane and unprecedented. So you need to call the only precious metal dealer I trust, American Hartford Gold. They will show you how to protect your savings and retirement accounts by diversifying your portfolio with physical gold and silver. Please call them today and they will have physical gold and silver delivered right to your door or put inside your IRA or 401k. They have thousands of satisfied customers of the highest rated firm in the country with an A-plus rating from the Better Business Bureau. Tell them Bill O'Reilly sent you and they'll give you up to $2,500 of free silver on your first order. Please call 866-501-5201, 866-501-5201, or text Bill to 65532. Again, 866-501-5201 or text bill to 65532.